A private demolition company has begun breaking up the Nimrod aircraft. Screens were erected around the aircraft to deter onlookers. Despite growing criticism, the nine aircraft were scrapped following the defence review in October 2010. These two planes, thought to be only a few weeks away from their first test flight, will suffer the same fate. In an open letter to the Daily Telegraph, six former defence chiefs from three services called the decision to scrap the Nimrod aircraft perverse. However, there are now reports that there were hundreds of design faults with the aircraft and that the project should have been cancelled years ago. The planes, which are already paid for at a cost of £4 billion, will now cost a further £200 million to break up. 500 jobs at BAE Systems in Woodford will now be lost a year sooner than expected.